As the wild ride that is NFL free agency begins the Redskins Talk podcast is ready to keep you prepared and informed. Our NFL free agency tracker has you covered, but for in-depth analysis, you have to tune in to Redskins Talk. J.P. Finley, Mitch Tischler and Peter Haley will command the airwaves all throughout the week as they discuss the biggest moves around the league and for the Redskins as players and teams begin to make deals. Starting Monday, March 11th and going through Friday, March 15th, the Redskins Talk crew will be live streaming on the My Teams by NBC Sports app every day from 12 p.m. to 1 p.m. ET wrapping up the biggest news from the day as familiar faces around the league head to new places. Additionally, there will be a bonus stream from 4 p.m. to 5 p.m. ET on Wednesday, March 13, the first official day of NFL free agency. If you haven't already downloaded the MyTeams app, you can do so right here. Click here to watch the daily live stream of the Redskins Talk podcast when, 12 p.m., 1 p.m., ET, Monday to Friday, 4 p.m. to 5 p.m., ET, Wednesday live stream, click to stream Redskins Talk podcast live every day this week. Want to subscribe to Redskins Talk, Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, Spotify, Stitcher, Art19 more Redskins news, Antonio Brown has reportedly found a new home. The former Steelers receiver is heading to the Raiders where, according to reports, he'll receive a guaranteed $30 million over the next three years. Honored and grateful for this opportunity, Brown posted on Instagram. God is great all the time all the time, God is great love you. The Redskins had at one point been reportedly in the mix for the talented wideout but were in a tough spot with salary cap hurdles and, according to NBC Sports Washington Redskins insider J.P. Finley, a reluctance to give up especially their first round draft pick, according to ESPN, the Steelers will receive a third and fifth round pick. The drama between the Steelers and Brown began late last season when Brown skipped practices and team meetings and didn't play in the final game. In February, he met with Steelers owner Art Rooney. Had a great meeting with Mr. Rooney today we discussed a lot of things and we cleared the air on several issues. We both agreed that it is time to move on, he tweeted. Had a great meeting with Mr. Rooney today we discussed a lot of things and we cleared the air on several issues. We both agreed that it is time to move on but I'll always have appreciation and gratitude towards the Rooney family and its Steelers organization. More Redskins news, the Redskins reached out to Eric Weddle before he ultimately signed with the Rams, a source told NBC Sports Washington. Los Angeles put out a tweet on Friday teasing the signing. Fear the Beard, Los Angeles Rams, at Rams NFL, March 8, 2019 NFL Network's Ian Rapoport then gave information on the contract. $10.5 million space. He considered retirement, but quickly landed back on the field. Ian Rapoport at Rap Sheet, March 8, 2019. Weddle, 34, was released by Baltimore earlier this week, most likely due to the fact that he represented a $6.5 million cap hit for the upcoming season. Despite earning his third consecutive Pro Bowl nod in 2018, Weddle did not generate a single turnover while starting every regular season game along with Baltimore's wild card appearance. This was following a 2017 campaign in which Weddle had six interceptions. Still, with the lack of production, the safety can be a valuable addition to the Rams, providing experience both on the field and in the locker room. Though Weddle initially said he would retire if he was not brought back by Baltimore this offseason, the money, proximity to his family and chance to win a Super Bowl must have changed his mind. Though the Redskins could have benefited from the addition of Weddle, this doesn't tank their offseason in any fashion. Washington is in need of safety help, with DJ. Swearinger's departure and haha Clinton Dix's questionable future in DC. Luckily for them, there are plenty of other options. A strong safety group enters free agency this offseason, including former Giants safety Landon Collins. As has been discussed, the 25-year-old is someone the Redskins will have on their radar in the coming days. More Redskins news.